Johnny Sauter, Todd Bodine, Kyle Bush is third. That second line backing up once again. Now Busher moves to the outside, leaves Ryan Truex in the middle. He has Miguel Paluto behind him, and around they go. Ryan Truex goes around. I think Ryan Truex had a tire go flat. Yeah, he started, it started smoking there, and he was trying to get out of that pack. See Ross Chastain, the 19 truck involved. We saw the 30. Oh, oh, what a get reason. loose, get wild. The 17 of Timothy Peters involved in this. A lot of damage to the front of that truck. What a restart this is going to be, fellas. The fifth caution comes out at Daytona, closing in on the final laps. And now the strategy will come into play. You see the 30 of Ryan Trucks. He's trying to get out of the way. I think you see that see left rear tire is flat. flat. John King does a nice job getting by, and then then it just loses control. Well, you see the tread yep, come off tread the tire down. all the way down. Ryan did an amazing job keeping that thing straight for ever so long, but then finally the tire went all the way away. See the damage on the seven of John West Townley as well as the 17 of Timothy Peters. They really had a run going, and then he felt that tire going down, doing his best. Look at the inside line. They're just jammed up there, nowhere to go. What about the job that James Busher did, recognizing that his that that 30 truck wasn't running right, and he was able to skip to the outside of Truex and call and kept from being a part of that accident. Another look. Ross Chastain just barely got a piece of that. Had a left rear tire go down. I wonder if he was able, if someone rubbed into the left side of him. You can see all the damage on that truck. Phil, and when when there's damage, there could have been something that rubbed that tire and it finally just went down. Yeah, quite possible. Right now that tire is flat. You see him, see him trying to get down to the bottom of the racetrack, but the line is just uh, just too thick with trucks. What about John King? He did an amazing job slipping by that baby, as did Ryan Sieg. Look at Sieg go by, and there's Agnew. All those guys taking a base of action and making it through. The seven of John West Townley got into the back of the 17 of Timothy Peters. Shoved